Hey yo! I hope you're having a good, uh, whatever your time zone is. But enough of the introduction, so today, because what we've got served on the slice of life today is Mark Cuban. Now, granted, this is a little bit of a older bit of news already at this rate, going by how the election and everything else is going, but. I think he's from the Dragon's Den. I, I I don't really know. I just know he has a lot of money, and I know that recently he did a uh, a show or he did a he had a speech on The View, in which he gave a very eh, very stupid take on The View about women, which is the the take is. First and foremost, the take is very, very ironic when he is on The View, or while he's on The View. Because I would not... Yeah, here, I'll, I'll let the clip play and then I'll give my speech from what I think. Donald Trump, you never see him around strong, intelligent women. Ever. It's just that simple. Donald Trump... You... I think it is quite hilarious that... He goes on The View, of all places, to talk about intelligent women. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, I would never put those women on that list. And he's talking about it so, so aptly on The View. That's kind of interesting of a take, in my opinion. Now, obviously, I disagree with uh, what he is saying here, in that... Trump has no intelligent women uh, with him. That's just a ludicrous take, because eventually you're going to find someone, just first and foremost, that's just off the basis of knowing how humans work, but also on the basis of just watching the people who, f who agree with him. There, I can already list a bunch of people, like you got Tulsi Gabbard, you got Riley Gaines, and the list just, it goes on, but I don't know, it's a stupid take, obviously, but let's get into what other people say. Now, uh, Trump obviously uh, came out with his own statement, <clears throat> it reads, Mark Cuban, a really dumb guy who thinks he is hot stuff. But he's absolutely nothing. Is now out there saying that I don't surround myself with strong women. Actually, he's very wrong. I surround myself with the strongest of women. With the understanding that all women are great, whether strong or not. This guy is such a fool. He's consistently on televising, being critical, and only for the reasons that I tuned him out completely while president because he called incessantly. I told him very pointedly, Look Mark, I've got a lot of things to do. I just can't be taking so many pointless calls from you. In any event, that affected him greatly because he's a very insecure guy and a major loser. Always has been, and always will be. Nobody likes him, nobody respects him, and he's unattractive both inside and out. He should go back to talk about the person he was forced to support because I didn't want it. Lion Kamala Harris. Also, he's got no club head speed. Not really sure what that means, but continuing on. I may in fact be surrounded by the strongest women in the world, including heads of countries who make Mark look like a baby. All strong women, and women in general, should be very angry about this weak man's statement. Could not agree more. Which I think is quite funny how a lot of women surround themselves with Kamala Harris, even though their political party is so apt to calling the opposition's women weak and unintelligent. Which I think uh, stands to go with the whole entire uh, men movement thing of uh, going out of country to look for uh, women to get into a relationships with. You saw women completely badgering them, being like, oh, the, the women over there are unintelligent, they are in... 
just yada 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 more and more spiel stick st stuff and it just speaks to me how quickly they will go to villainize people who they don't like they will villainize them immediately even though they're not too far off from themselves if we put it plainly uh tulsi gabbard all obviously had uh responded to mark cuban uh, saying all that and we're gonna listen to that For the last few days that mark cuban claims that president trump has no strong or intelligent women supporting him the premise of mark cuban's statement is that he believes that Liz Cheney and other female warmongers like her are strong women. This is not the case. They are hypocrites and cowards. They are eager to send our troops into war, my brothers and sisters into harm's way, and yet they themselves refuse to volunteer to put their own lives on the line on these military adventures that they're advocating for. This is not strength. This is hypocrisy and cowardice. Now, obviously, there was also a response from Riley Gaines. Let us check that out as well. All right, let's just unpack this really quick. Just in the past week alone, Trump supporters have been called by virtually every media outlet. Uh, we have been called garbage by the sitting United States president. Uh, and now Mark Cuban has come out and said there is no such thing as a strong, intelligent, female supporter of Donald Trump because they don't exist. Respectfully, Mark Cuban, you would not know a strong, intelligent female if she slapped you across the face, which you're such a beta, you might actually kind of like that. So if you are a healthcare provider, if you are a school teacher, if you are a US military member and you are a woman and a Trump supporter, then to Mark Cuban, you are stupid and weak. If this woman right here, Tulsi Gabbard, a lieutenant colonel in the U.S. Army. If this is not a strong, intelligent woman, then what is? Actually, I already know Mark Cuban's answer. This is who Mark Cuban believes to be a strong, intelligent woman. Although we really shouldn't be too surprised that a comment like this would come out of Mark Cuban's mouth, considering that he says border czar Harris has done a good job at the southern border, which maybe we just have different ideas of what constitutes as a good job, but to me... Uh, the illegal entrance of 13,000 murderers, 16,000 rapists, and the 320,000 missing children certainly doesn't fit the bill. It doesn't seem like continually disparaging more than half the country less than a week before election day is an effective strategy to get your candidate elected. But what do I know? I'm just a stupid, weak woman. Now, I find this particularly funny. Because uh, Riley Gaines, you know, uh, I mean, if you don't know, then I'm here to let you know. She's quite a big advocate on uh, women. <laughs> Real women, that is to say. And it is funny how someone who who is, I'm assuming, either liberal or leftist would go out to say that the right or Republicans don't have strong and intelligent women when they don't even know what the definition of that is. That, that is. that is an equation to me saying there are no strong water bottles in the, Repu in the Republican Party. This is a woman. They don't know what it is. So, it's just funny how he's so apt to... to qualify as to what a strong woman is when he doesn't even know how to define that because if he did then he'd fall out of line in the liberal party of what they believe now here comes the little bit of funny stuff that i put in here uh from the Babylon b uh they say mark cuban inspires a thousand by proving even the very rich can become wealthy great economy let me tell you this was my favorite one because as i stated they don't know what a woman is so maybe he's one of them <laughs> donald trump you never see him around strong intelligent women ever it's just that simple donald trump you now you know what would have made this even better is if now i don't i once again i don't know if this video is like AI edited or 
to just put a filter over it. Or maybe they edited it in a different way. But I wish they would have included like the, the sassy hands uh, of, of, you know, uh, just sassy hands, the, the extremely long eyelashes. I wish they would have went ham with making the myth making Mark Cuban into one of these left weirdo looking people because it would it, like it fits the speech even perfectly Donald Trump you never see him around strong while he's saying that I can imagine him just saying Donald Trump <laughs> like <laughs> eh, it's perfect it is quite perfect all right anywho that is pretty much all I had to say on this because uh not a whole lot to go off of here just other than the fact that Mark Cuban's being a dumbass to sorry gotta use the correct word here a stupid person um I don't know it's crazy I think it's a little bit weird obviously how he's so apt to calling out what a strong and intelligent woman would be voting for but they don't even know what that is oddly enough so it's a little bit a little bit weird to say the least anywho uh yeah i got nothing to say other than this is stupid have a good one